how to use bottom application my name is Shahid and welcome to my channel today guys we will talk about how to use bottom application the certain features how to make calls audio calls and video calls uh, so first of all if you don't have an account uh, I already make a video and you can find the link in the description below that how to create an account on bottom application today we will discuss the certain features so first of all as you can see down there at the bottom there is a menu and we are at the chats so once you click on the chat here I did not start a chat with anyone so if you can see up there at the right corner uh, there is a plus sign so when you click on the plus sign you will find new messages new call new group call new group chat add contact and scan QR code so I will click on new message so once you click on the new messages so the people who are already in your contact list you can find them here if they're on the bottom application so you can find them here and to anyone you can send a text message from here so i will select any person from here and then i will send a text message so select and then you can just send any text message as you can see there is a single tick that means that the message has been sent but not yet delivered so this is how you can do and with that there you can see you can send you can access to your camera to take picture and send then you can click on the gallery and send some pictures which is already in your mobile storage you can send videos you can send your location as well you can send a contact as well and you can send a file uh, as well so there are many options that you can do and here is as you can see there is a direct option to your camera as well you can click on the camera and you can send and here at the left side as you can see there are emojis so you will find many emojis here that you can send uh, in your chat to make it more fun so how to make a, a call as you can see on the top uh, if you open any chat like this one I will open it for you again at the, at the top you can see there is a video call option and there is an audio call option it's similar to to whatsapp but here you can find the two options and you can call any person which is in your contact list like an audio call or a video call which is free of cost so here is another option if you click on the three uh, dots at the top there and you can see view contact when you go to the view contact you can see the number of that person you can even mute uh, the notification you can either text message video call and audio call from here as well so you can do that as well and if you click on that and you can see media if you have shared any media like uh, you send pictures or videos or you even send some links or documents you can find them here it's like a shortcut to them there is another thing that you can change the wallpaper as well so here we have two so you can select any one of the wallpaper or you can click on the camera option so it will take you to your gallery and from there you can select any picture and which you can make your background uh, picture as well so these are the option and then the last option is the clear chat so once you click on the clear chat all the chat will be deleted from here as you can see i just sent a high message and now it's been deleted so this is how you can do the second option in the menu below is the explore one so once you click on the explore here you will find instant games so when you click on the instant games here are many games that you can play online there are many options there are some puzzle game action and new stuff as well here so you can find many games of your interest here and you can play it so this is how you can explore some games here here is the contacts you will find your contacts the people who are already added to your con to your phone contact if they are using bottom application so you can find them here and you can contact them then there is another option which is me when you click on me it means that it is your profile so here as you can see uh, this is my profile from here you can change your profile picture as well so once once you click on the profile photo option you will find gallery and camera so once you click on camera it will open your camera and you can take a picture and make it your profile picture but if you want to um, choose a picture from your gallery so just click on the gallery and it will take you to your gallery and you can choose a picture from there and you can make it your profile picture here you can edit your name as well anytime you can edit it 
and you can add your status as well like busy available or you can write down your own status as well like driving in the car in class anyone you can select and uh, you can make it your status here yeah. so uh, down below there is another very really important option which is account once you go to the account the first option is my number so it will show the number which you used uh, to activate your account the next one is your privacy so in the privacy you can say that who can see my personal information so here i select everyone when you click on it you will find three options everyone my contact or nobody so i will make it my contact it depends on you that what you choose for it status is for my contact i will change it as well last scene has three options as well everyone my account or nobody so uh, if you don't want to show uh, the people that your contact list that um, that when you were last online so you can select nobody or you want only your contact so you can select contact so here at the bottom there is another option where you can see the blocked contacts so here you will find the blocked people that the people who you already blocked if you did not block you want to block someone then add on new and you can add any person just click on that option and it will be suppose i selected this one and so this contact is now being blocked so you can come back here and you can actually unblock the person just click on that uh, contact and it will show you are you sure you want to unblock this person so you can select confirm and this person will be unblocked again so this is how you can do it uh, so these are the privacy options and then the other option is delete my account so if you don't want your account so you can delete it uh, delete your account from bottom it is your messaging history to delete your account confirm your country region code and enter your phone number so you need to enter the phone number you are using for your bottom account and put it here and then you can just click on delete my account and your account will be deleted so this is how you can delete your account so the second important option in the, in your account uh, just below your account setting is the chats where you can see that uh, chat background you can select the background or you can just select from the gallery there is an option as well you can select any picture so it will be your background picture auto download uh, here is like photos uh, wi-fi and cellular network you see that uh, the pictures or anything that people sent you the media files it will be downloaded automatically so uh, the option now they choose is wi-fi and cellular so if i put it on wi-fi so it will only be downloaded on Wi-Fi if I don't want to use my cellular internet. So then full images. So on Wi-Fi or Wi-Fi cellular as well. So you can choose anyone or you can just choose none. Videos on Wi-Fi because sometimes the files are big. You don't want to use your data. So that's how you can do it. Reset auto download settings. So if you want to reset it just click on it and it will reset again as you can see so this is how the chats options work then there is a notification one notification tone so once you click on notification tone you can select there are many tones here and you can select any tones from the list and use high priority notification you can click and then it will show you preview the, the messages will be preview if you uh, enable it or you can disable it anytime so it is on you then notification tone as well so what you want if you want vibration any messaging or coming and you need a vibration so you can put it on short long or default or you can just off it as well use high priority notification for your messaging um, so you can choose that one as well then call notification at the bottom as you can see so you can choose any of these options which you can use as your call on bottom is a ringtone of your uh, bottom application so here is the vibrate option as well if you off it or you make it on default so i will make it off because i don't like the vibration so it you can choose it for your own choice so this is how the notification works so guys i hope you like the video if you find this video useful please like and subscribe our channel and don't forget to press the bell icon for more informative videos please stay tuned and i will bring you more videos in the future till then take care bye bye
so distant when you're home